Good morning, Nonprofit Networking Cafe family. I decided I was going to do a live stream today to talk to you guys about my topic for today. So my topic is uh, praise. Praise is part of the experience. So as most of you know, my name is Tiffany Taylor Hicks, and I am one of the founders of the Nonprofit Networking Cafe, as well as I am the CEO of Velvet Rope Experience. And today's topic was to discuss how important praise is as it relates to your business or as it relates to your nonprofit. So one of the things that I'm really good at my business is uh, 15 plus years of experience in the customer service world as well as the problem solving world. Um, I have a master's degree in management as well as I have, I'm working on my second master's in community development, which is the reason why I love to um, bridge the gap between nonprofit and for-profit. Um, but there are so many similarities in the things that businesses, for-profit and non-profits do. And I want to make sure that I'm able to bring some of that information to you guys so that you can have strong non-profit organizations as well as if you are also a for-profit um, owner as well. Because a lot of people couple um, those, meaning that they have a for-profit that they use to generate revenue, but they also have a non-profit that helps them with giving back to the community. So. One of the things I wanted to talk to people about is the experience. So experience is so important no matter what you do, whether you are attempting to be a leader in your household or if you are leading your business or if you are leading your nonprofit, experience is, is so uh, paramount to whether or not you build loyalty, whether or not people want to work with you, whether or not people are interested in having longevity with your business or with your nonprofit. So I'm talking about experience today. And one of those components of experience is praise. So I want to read something to you guys. And this was part of what I posted. So um, every person desires acceptance on some level. If they say that they don't care what other thinks, I can guarantee you that they care what they think of themselves. We all desire praise and recognition of some kind. When people desire it, don't withhold it from them. It deepens the relationship, it uplifts, it affirms, and it promotes positive behavior. So when I say that, I want you guys to know that we all desire praise of some sort, whether we pray, we desire that, you know, that God is proud of what we've done, whether we care whether or not our family is proud, our employees, our community, we all care and want to be affirmed in some way for the goodness that we do or for the performance that we are given um, or for the help that we give or how we serve. Um, but the thing about praise is that not only is praise good for the person who is receiving it, but it's also good for the person who is giving it. Um, praise helps you feel good, but it also helps the other person feel good. And it's, it's a humongous part of the experience when you're dealing with people. So if you are a for-profit and you're dealing with people, you want to praise your customers. You want to tell them when they're doing things right. Um, you want to praise your employees. You want to make sure that they know that you that they are doing things well or that they are behaving in a way that is, is productive or that is positive. Also, if you have a nonprofit, you want to make sure that you are praising people. So you should be praising your board members when praise is due. You should be praising your volunteers. And most importantly, you should be praising your um, clients or your participants in your programs. So just understanding that praise is part of the experience. If you want people to have a good and memorable and positive experience of your business or of your nonprofit, you want to become familiar with praise. So if you're one of those people that you withhold praise from people, like you don't want to tell them that they did a good job and you don't want to pat people on the back, you're going to find it difficult to nurture relationships um, because most the, the whole point to nurturing um, when you nurture something, you take care of it, you water it, you make sure that it grows, you make sure that you take care of, you care for its well-being, and that's what praise is. Praise is a positive expression of how you feel about a person um, or about a thing. So if you are struggling with praising people, then that's something you really should consider. You should consider what could you do to be um, more um 
apathetic or what could you do to, to praise people more? What could you do to show them more appreciation for who they are, what they do, and what they have accomplished? So that's just a little bit. If you guys want to know more, I will be giving some tips this evening at around 9 p.m. I will be doing a um, um, three tips on how to create opportunities to praise those that need it in your organization, whether it's for-profit or non-profit. So this evening at 9 p.m., I will be broadcasting a little bit longer. I'll be talking to you a little bit more in depth about how to grow praise and how to utilize praise to nurture your organization, as well as nurture the growth of those that are involved or in direct partnership with your organization. So again, my name is Tiffany Taylor Hicks, and I am one of the founders of the Nonprofit Networking Cafe, as well as I am the owner of and CEO of Velvet Rope Experience. So as you guys will hear a lot of, of information from me about experiences and how to create positive experiences for your clients, as well as for those that are involved in your nonprofit networking organization. So I hope that this was helpful, but I also hope that you guys will join me again later on this evening at around 9 p.m. I will be doing a live that will be talking about three tips to create praise opportunities, and I'll be giving you guys um, some tips on what you can do. So hope to see you again a little bit later and enjoy your holiday with family and with friends. Have a great day.